Each week, we infuse the richness of love and relationships with the goodness of great food. I am so excited about tonight's guest. First of all, I love dessert. Anyone who knows me knows I love cake. We have Vicki from Good Damn Cake who's going to share one of her favorite recipes. So come right back and we'll get started. Welcome back to Love Dish. I'm K.S. Lewis, and just like I promised, my special guest tonight is Miss Vicki from Good Damn Cake. Hi. Hello. Oh my goodness, I'm so glad you're here. Um, I, I'm going to give you this apron to put on, but just first, let me tell you, first of all, I love dessert. I love your cake. And so oh, to have you here tonight is such a treat in itself. So thank let's you. get started first. I know that you like to use, yes. and look at y'all, she has her, she brought her own special apron with her tonight. So we're, you know, yes. Love Dish and Vicky going yes. at it. Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. Thank you for having me. No thank problem. So before you tell us about the special uh, treat that we're going to have tonight, just tell me a little bit about how you even got started with Good Damn Cake. Okay, so really, honestly, I've been baking since high school. Okay. And it's, it's always been And that couldn't passion. have been more than two years ago. Absolutely not. I mean, years and years ago. Yeah, okay. years and years ago. <laughs> and well, I've you always... Young, honey. Two, thank you, thank you. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. <laughs> and, you know, in high school I baked. Uh, I baked for the cheerleaders right before wow. our game. So it's always been a passion of mine to always okay. bake. Uh, I would bake for my kids. Uh, but now they're older, so, you know, it's just my turn. Okay. Um, to do something for me. I've always been focused on my boys. Uh, I have a 24 year old, I have a 19 year old, 17 year old. So um, I got started one day, honestly, in the kitchen. Okay. Um, I had this recipe, I wanted to try it really bad. So then my husband and my son was out. So I said, okay, I'm going to try it. So I made it when he came in the house. And I said, Dad, you got to try this cake. Right. Okay, let me know what you think. Got to try so this he cake. Did, right. <laughs> he tried it and he walked in the kitchen. Right. And he came back out the kitchen and he was like, Man, this is damn cake. <laughs> so that's where you took his breath from. away with that, right? He, I really did, and he, you know, he really was so inspired. He was like, you know, we have to have the world know about this cake. Yeah. So that's where this cake came from. That's where it came yes, from. Absolutely. So came in the kitchen, tried it. Yes. Made the proclamation. This is some good damn cake, and good damn cake was born from that moment. I love it. So tell us a little bit about what you are making tonight. Okay, so tonight we are going to make um, my sweet potato drops. Okay, and uh, this is something I came up with also at home. Uh, my mind just kind of swirls around when it comes to baking. Yes. So I always have thoughts up in there. Okay. So what we're going to do today? We're going to have uh, my sweet potato drops. And we're gonna have uh, my sauce that goes with it. Yes. And we're gonna also have some uh, some um, cinnamon and sugar also Ooh. to go with it. So we're gonna have two different. So we have drops. options. We have options. options. We have yes. options. Today. I love so options. It's gonna be a lot of fun. And that sauce looks so delicious. yummy. I can't wait. Yes, this is my signature butter sauce. So Ooh, okay, so we have this. sweet potato drops. Yes. A signature butter sauce. Absolutely. Cinnamon and sugar. Yeah, and some icing. And yes, and the icing. All we I'm need show you what the icing goes is with. Your, some booze. And that's, that's it. And I mean, I, and that's I'm it. talking about your husband and my man. That's it. Do I have a man? That's it. Well, time will tell. <laughs> and it'll be a special night. This is. I mean, this really seems like a real, like almost could be a seductive almost dessert. Yes, it like is. Something it's you really, really want to be special for someone. It's, I can't wait for you to try it. It's really good. I can't. You wait know, you can have it with coffee. You can have it with tea. Yeah. You can have it with wine. For your man. Yes. Or your man. Or your man. So we will Absolutely. be right back and we will get started on the sweet potato drops with the special dipping sauce on Love Dish. Hi everyone, I am Mr. Brian Lamont. I am a wardrobe stylist, personal shopper, and media personality. You can find me at almost every single 
fashion, networking, or entertainment event that you can name. Catch me on all social media platforms at Mr. Brian Lamont. Until next time, peace. Welcome back to Love Dish. I'm K.S. Lewis with Miss Vicky from Good Damn Cake. And we're going to get started. But first, you were talking just while we were taking our break. You were talking a little bit about how you and your husband met. And so I just want you to share that because that and just you all's relationship is really significant in how this got started, right? Yes. We met years and years ago. We've been married for 20 years. This wow. year's our 20th year. And uh, we happy, met actually. Happy anniversary. Thank happy you. Thank you. I appreciate it. Thank you. And actually, we met at a happy hour at a club okay. in DC. And um, he cooked, so I liked it. Oh. And uh, he chased me for six months. Okay. And I liked it. <laughs> right. <laughs> it was it was really good. So you know, the rest is history. Wonderful, yeah. wonderful. So those of you that are watching and listening, met at happy hour. <laughs> You had to have had a conversation that you enjoyed. Yes, he chased, she obliged, he cooks, she absolutely. likes it. So absolutely. yeah, absolutely. I love that because it's, it's it seems very partner influenced. Absolutely, it really yeah. is. absolutely. And that's how it works. You know, you have a partner. Yes, a partner for life. most you grow certainly. Each year together. Mm -hmm. So that's a good thing. Most certainly. And so you are, being an entrepreneur is kind of, um, I guess, a second win for you as far as you did some other things first and then you came into being an entrepreneur recently. So tell us what drew what drove that decision. Well, first, I, my mom, mm -hmm. so my kids play football, um, very active, and I have one that's in the music business. So I constantly was on the go with them. Mm. Everything was about them. Yes. and But I still baked. Um, for them, mm -hmm. but so it's always there. But as soon as they were at age um, that they could branch off, and I made sure that they were okay. Right. Then it was my turn. Yes. And so I wanted to do something, but I wanted to focus to make sure I focused on what I love to do because you gotta love what you do. That's so true. That's the main thing. That's so true. Absolutely. So true. And you love what you do, Absolutely. and we're going to love eating these sweet potato drops. So tell us kind of about the process of how they're made. Okay, so because we know we don't want you to share what's in them, but right. but if you could just kind of help people, mm -hmm. if if there's a way that they can make them at home mm -hmm. with some ingredients that they have kind of help them with that. Absolutely. So you start with the cake. So this is my signature, Vicky Signature Sweet Potato Pound Cake. Okay? So you start with Good that. Stuff. Okay. So um so yeah, so what you do, you keep cutting the cake that you would purchase right on goddamncake.com. That's right. Because we want people to go to your website and purchase your cake to be Absolutely. able to, to mimic this recipe. Absolutely. So what you would do is you would actually put the cake inside. Okay. And it is a bit of a process, but it's a fun process. Yeah, you know, fun with it. I just want a slice of the cake right now, but it's then, okay. <laughs> we're gonna have fun. We're gonna put our gloves on. All right. This is the fun part. This is the part. And people can use any glove that makes sense, right? Because these absolutely. are latex. But these if there's a, if there's someone with a latex allergy, absolutely, we don't want them thinking that they can't make right. this if they don't have latex. So just absolutely. find whatever gloves work for you. Yes, whatever gloves work for you. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna get down and dirty with it. All right. Okay. So what do what we do next is we're gonna mush it up. Ooh. Okay, so if you wanna make this at home, like I said, you get your cake. Okay. Gooddamncake.com. Yes. And you get you the good damn cake first. Absolutely. And then could you grab the um icing for me? Absolutely. Show you. I'm food chefing it today. Yes. So you were uh, dump some icing in. We're okay. gonna try half at a time. Okay. Okay. So now I like to make my own icing, but you know you can use the store brand. You can use it. Go to the store and you get your own your own store brand, mm -hmm. whichever brand you want to use. That's uh, about enough. Okay. There. Okay. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna get nice, nice and messy with it. All right. Okay. Good and messy. Yes. And I'm just gonna slide this right Thank here. And this is really where you put your love into it. This yes. is really where you put your love into because, it. Because, I mean, and, and if you are doing it with a loved one, mm -hmm. this is an opportunity for you both to have your hands in the Absolutely. bowl together. You Absolutely. Know, you it's might get so a little squeeze fun. on one another. Absolutely. It's a lot of fun. It's a lot of fun. I'm letting her have all the fun right now. <laughs> That's okay. It's okay. <laughs> but it, look, it smells divine. 
It's so much fun, but you're about to have some fun too. Uh oh, okay. So don't worry. All right. If you could add just a little more ice. Okay. That's it. Okay. That's good. Okay. So once you get this really mixed up really well, mm -hmm. that's when you will start creating your drops. Awesome. And this is the fun part. And so the icing creates a, the binding agent for the Absolutely. cake, right? Absolutely. Absolutely. So the cake is already completed. You buy the cake from GoodDamnCake.com. You buy, you get whatever icing you prefer. Right. But it serves as a binding agent Absolutely. to make the balls themselves. Absolutely. Right. All right. Here we go. Uh -oh. So this is what I want you to do. I'm gonna do the first one. Okay. Okay. And I'm just gonna slide this right over here. And a regular cookie sheet is fine to use. A regular right? cookie sheet is fine. And you can make it as big as you want, as small as you want, whatever size. Whatever you, size balls whatever you your prefer. Preference is. And we just get in here, it's like you in art class so or home at the moment. Do I just grab is. some like this? Yes, you just grab some okay. and you roll it. So you can make them as big as you want, awesome. as small as you want. You're going to have some fun. I'm being 12 in my mind right it's now. It's okay, but you know but. what? We all have a kid in us. <laughs> we do. And that's how you live. It's so true. That's how you so live. So true. Keeping the so, youthfulness alive. Absolutely. So you continue. This one's a little bigger than yours, but. That's okay. That's fine. You know what? That, that's the beauty I of it. I think it's still somewhat bite size. That's all right. There you go. And there then you, you put them, um, you just load up the cookie sheet, you right? Load up the cookie sheet. Okay. Load up the cookie sheet. Let's see. So, so you told us how you actually um, created Good Damn Cake or how the company created, yeah. but how did you decide, because you bake so many different things, how did you decide that this was going to be your signature dish? Oh, you know what? That was really easy. Okay. Because I love sweet potatoes. Oh, I do too. I'm a huge sweet potato fan. Mm -hmm. So this was one I really, really, really wanted to make. Okay. And I have been going back and forth, back and forth, how I was going to make this. And uh, when I made it, it was literally the first time. And I really? Knew, literally the first time. Wow. And so I knew it had to be my signature. It oh had to goodness. be the one. It had to be the one that I made. And so what are some of the other uh, the other cakes or other desserts that you really enjoy? That you I'm, I know you like all of them, yes. of course. But with this being your signature because mm -hmm. you like sweet potatoes, like what's their second favorite? My second favorite, as in cakes or just desserts. Wh whichever. Or well, both. I do, you know, I, I do love um, peach cobbler. Oh, I do too. Yes, I love mm. peach cobbler. So that's one. That one right there. And banana pudding. You're saying all yes. the classics. Yes, because you know what? You can never get too much. That's true. Of classics. That's so you true. Really can not, you never get too much of classics. So And so I'm from the South. Okay. And so peach cobbler, banana pudding, sweet potato cake, all the well really sweet potato pie. Those are things that are just staples. Yes, they are. On su you know, for Sunday dinner. Yes, they in are. In my mom's house. Absolutely. You know? Absolutely. And it's so funny. I just recently, like within the last year, learned how to make peach cobbler. Really? Yeah. There's so many ways it's embarrassing. you can make it. Don't tell anybody. <laughs> but <laughs> so many ways you can make it. Yes. So, okay. So how do you balance? Mm -hmm. So you talked about being able to go and spend time with your sons and run back and forth with them, enjoying what they do. How do you balance now the joys of motherhood, being a wife and being an entrepreneur? Because that takes, I'm sure those Think those three things alone just pull mm -hmm. from you so much. How do you how do you balance those things successfully? Really, honestly, scheduling. Okay, scheduling, scheduling. is important. It is really important. Uh, my boys understand they are huge uh, supporters, so they know if, if I have something to do, mm -hmm. they know. Okay, mom, it's okay. Uh -huh. You know, you can go and do what you need to do. But honestly, scheduling. Okay. Scheduling is huge for me. Uh, my calendar. I have to have a calendar. For everything mm -hmm. with my boys I have a calendar so once I have everything scheduled out then it's good to go absolutely <laughs> absolutely well I love it sweet potato balls dipping sauce absolutely. and scheduling to keep everything and everyone in place and we are gonna take a quick break and we will be right back you'll come back and see the finished product absolutely we'll be right back on love dish for the novelty
Welcome back to Love Dish. We, listen, first, let's clear something up for everybody. Because we spent the whole time that we've been rolling the cake around, we've been calling them balls. Yes. And that is not the real name Absolutely of this not. dish. It is? Sweet potato drops. Sweet potato drops. So for all of you out there that are 12 like me and been calling it balls, it's sweet potato drops. We like them both though. So. <laughs> Okay, so we've we've put the icing in the cake, we've put it all together, we have it here. Now what's the next step? So the next step is to add my signature butter sauce. Ooh, okay. Yummy. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna right. go ahead and roll them and we also have some cinnamon and sugar. Okay. Okay, so we're gonna do one with the butter sauce and then we're gonna also do one with the cinnamon and sugar. Okay. So what you wanna do is you wanna grab one of your drops. Mm -hmm. And I have a whole pan and you have a whole pan. Yes. So. I'm gonna and eat all of these, by the way. Yes. And you're gonna roll them around, so you can roll it around. Already not listening, right? That's okay. It's okay. <laughs> this is, you know what? It's fun. You have to have fun. It is fun. You have to have fun. This reminds me of like almost like an, a craft, an arts and crafts project. Almost. Absolutely. Because I'm not. I'll be honest. I'm not a baker. I feel like people that that bake excellently are they either bake or cook. So I cook food, like I'll go in the kitchen, I'll make, you know, whatever. But when you talk about baking, I feel like that's so precise and so, you know. But you know what, like, when you make <gasps> this it is fun, fun though. when you make it fun, you don't think about that. That's so right? true. Can I put more than one drop on here? Absolutely. <laughs> and I want you to also um, try it with the butter sauce. Okay. I want you to be able to do that. I want you to have some fun with the butter sauce. Yes. It's I delicious. Amazing butter sauce. Yes. Ooh. I'm just going at it over here with okay. these. I feel like I don't have enough cinnamon sugar on there, but. You can put as much as you want. As or as little as I want, right? Absolutely. Okay. So then you, I didn't watch what you did, so I guess That's I okay. take one, you right? Take one. You can take one and you can put it in there. I put it in. Mm -hmm. You can roll okay. it around with it. You can always use your hands or you can also use the spoon. You can do either. Absolutely. I think I'm gonna use the spoon tonight. <laughs> But on another occasion, I might opt to use my hands. You never doing know. good. Yes. Oh my goodness. Great. He's doing good. Okay. I like that. This is cool. Go ahead and drop it down. Okay. Now, so of course, we do a lot of talking here about relationships. Mm -hmm. So if a relationship were a cake, what type of ingredients should go in for it to be a good cake? If a relationship was a cake. For it to be a good damn cake. And it were, if it, what what kinds of ingredients would a relationship need, need to be good damn cake equivalent? As far as food. What no, type of food or a relationship. Just, well, a relationship would have to be mm -hmm. delicious. Mm. Right? Delicious. It would have to be delicious. Okay. It would have to <laughs> what be. makes it delicious? I've well, got to hear this. <laughs> Indulge I mean, me. Like we're using by, all these wonderful food words, right? What I mean by delicious, uh huh, it has to it has to go you have to go with the flow. Okay. You know, you um, in a relationship you have to have that balance. Yes. You know, and to me that's delicious. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, it has to be sweet. Okay. And that's from the beginning. Okay. So you have to have that ingredient in okay. a relationship. And uh, huge, huge, huge. You have to have. Yes. And you have to slide that in there from the beginning. Ooh. Okay. Slide so you have all that. in. You have all that. Mmm. And you're good. I love it. Yeah, absolutely. So we're sliding okay. communication in, making it sweet from the beginning. Absolutely. And all of that together absolutely. makes for a delicious cake. A delicious right? cake. Absolutely. I love you're doing that. awesome. Am I really? Yes. Are you just, no, really, you are doing really good. <laughs> I am really trying here. Absolutely, you're doing great. All right. See, and it's fun. It is fun. It's a lot of fun. It is fun. That's I don't want to put too much, but okay. I guess you said it's it doesn't it's however much I want, right? Absolutely. I think Absolutely. I'm gonna go back to rolling in the sugar All right, though. There you go. <laughs> now you've talked about being an entrepreneur, being organized, being able to successfully navigate between your family, between the business. Um, what advice would you give to someone who is considering going into entrepreneurship? Do what you love. Okay. Uh, whatever your passion is. Mm -hmm. Stick with your passion and don't ever give up. 
Okay. Um, and you, like I said, you do what you love, but you you really have to put your all in it. I and always that. uh surround yourself with people who want to support you. That's so that's key. That's that so is important. So important. That is so important. But never give up. Even when you have those days, never give up. Just keep going. What Just kind of going. days? Give me an example. You may what have is a, a busy bad day, day for good damn cake? Oh, yeah. Because everything is sweet and wonderful and I can't imagine you having a bad day well, you may making be, good stuff like this all the time. Oh no, but you may be up late. Okay. Okay. So you may have to stay up late. Mm -hmm. Like asleep. But mm. it's okay. So you can get to sleep next day. That's right. Absolutely. And it's doing what you love, and right? And doing what you love. And that's the main thing, doing what you love. So Absolutely. key. So key. So making sure that you do what you love, making sure that you're patient, Absolutely. that you're in it for the long haul, and that you bounce back from bad days. Bounce back from bad days. Right? We all have them, but it's okay. We, it's okay. So true. Absolutely. I want to bite this so bad right now. <laughs> oh, I'm going to wait. No, I'm going to wait. Okay. I'm going to wait. But I feel like I have a good amount here that yes. I can test out. Absolutely. Yeah. All right. Well, so we took good damn cake. We kind of mushed it up with icing. Yes. We have your signature dipping sauce, the butter sauce. Yeah, absolutely. It's delicious. The cinnamon and sugar or whatever kind of topping, I guess, that you would want to roll it in. That you would want to roll it in. But you always start with the cake. Good start with cake. the cake. Start with good damn cake. Start with the butter sauce, cinnamon Absolutely. sugar, and go from there. So Absolutely. you guys saw the process. So make sure that you take the time to order a cake so you can try it at home. We will be right back on Love Dish and you'll see us take a bite. Welcome back to Love Ditch. I'm KS Lewis and we have brought it all together. We have the sweet potato drops. Yes. We finally, I finally got it right. Got the name right at the end. <laughs> but we have the cinnamon sugar ones and then we have also your special dipping sauce. Butter sauce. Butter, butter sauce. sauce. Special sweet. butter sauce. Sweet. So I have one last question that I ask every guest that comes on the show. Okay. What is your greatest hope for love? Wow. I hope that everyone gets to experience love okay. for years and years and years. And if it's through baking, and mm -hmm. if it's through um, cooking, and just being together. But my, I'm, I'm really hoping that more people get to experience love, but long love. I love long that. Love. Experience long love long for love. years to come. And I Absolutely. tell you what, if they have some good damn cake, it will be very easy for them to do Absolutely. So. Why don't you tell everyone, tell all of our viewers how they can reach you and how they can keep up with what you're doing. Yes, you can reach me. If you want to order a cake, you can go to www.gooddamncake.com and all over social media at gooddamncake.com. So I just want to thank you so much for coming. Thank you all for watching. We are going to try the sweet potato drops with the butter dipping sauce. I got it right. Yes! <laughs> and thank Finally. you for having me. Oh, thank you. It. And I just want to do a quick cheers before we get started because once I get started on eating, I'm not I'm not even going to be thinking about this. All right. But thank you again for coming. Thank you for having me. <laughs> and if you would like to order from Good Damn Cake or just see the process all over again, see the comments below, subscribe to the show, and we will see you next week. Now it's time to grab. Yes. I'm gonna get one of each. Oh, there we go. I'm going in. Yes. <laughs> mm. This is some good damn cake, girl. Oh, yes. <laughs> Thank you for tuning in. We'll see you next week.